Here's Medusa having a little snack. We got one head having a little fuzzy today, one's having a pinky. And uh, that's basically how we feed Medusa. We've got to keep both heads occupied because although they get along just fine, during feeding time they tend to uh, both like to try to eat the same food item. But as long as they both get a snack, they're cool. Hey, Tom. The one head's going to finish early. Do we just uh, let it go, or do you want to try to feed another pinky to keep her occupied? Uh, just run defense for the business card. Okay, let's see how she does. Will she usually go right over and try to take her food? Yeah. She's getting it down pretty fast, so. She's still got the tail hanging out of her mouth. Let her finish hers. Come on. <laughs> She's already ready for another little, another little piece, huh? Normally, Tom, when you feed them both the same size food item, they generally... They finish about the same time. time. Then no problem. We're trying to get our little bit older food item to promote some, some better growth. Instead of just pinkies. So sometimes we alternate two pinkies, a fuzzy and a pinky, two fuzzies. Now, Tom, is the other head trying to, like, get across that barrier, or is he just chilling? Uh, he's just hanging out right now. Cool. Now, that, that other pinky's already, already down there, you can see. It's already passed, passed by where her, her necks can join. <clears throat> and then this one will, will be next. Yeah, he's trying to come over. Oh, is he really? Yeah. She. She, Tom, come on. <laughs> I wish I'd use a regular camera for this, because the iPhone camera, I think, is uh, it's good, but it's not, like, great. Medusa. She's getting ready to shed, too. She always eats. Regardless, it seems. Now, which head is this? The left head? Barbara? No. Do we have names for the individual heads? <laughs> Thought we did. Oh, how cute. Well, now, what's the other head doing now behind the barrier? Just chilling? Yeah, uh, just hanging oh, out. Oh, it's realigning its jaw. Yeah. And now we'll give her a bath, actually, because she smells the mouse on either head. She may try and go for that head. Is she getting better with that as she gets older, or is she... No, we give her a bath every time. Give her a bath every time. I've tried to just wait and see what happens, and usually within a couple of minutes, one head will bite the other. All right, and you, what do you just use, uh, just water to wash them off? Yeah, just rinse them off really good, rub the head down. And there goes the fuzzy down. Cool. Good video.